And by contrast, on debut, Max Gorn. They say 208 centimetres. It doesn't look like 208, I've got to say, but even so, he's a tall man, 6'10 in the old. He's wearing number 37, a number worn by Jim Steins in his early days. A lot to look forward to on what is a beautiful Friday night for football. The Bombers, there's our man up front. That's not 6'10 or 208 centimetres, I don't think. It's big. He doesn't, he doesn't look narrow, does he? So if he's 208 centimetres, which he probably is, it means he's pretty thick already. So we'll get Richo out there to check his boot size. <laughs> it's Melbourne, and that's what you look for. So, Gorn was the third man up. But when they do, they do take contested marks. Gorn goes up, taps it down. Ah, that's that's a big swing. Melbourne have started terrifically well. Love it, Murray, smothered off the boot. Gorn, missed it. So Zaharakis kicks to about 30 metres. Big fly came from Bell Chambers. Three Jets goals. So Watts gets their third. Demons lead by 11 points. But they are going to try and run it out with precision, Melbourne. They're uh, going to hold on to the ball to do that. So in the back half, handball from Gisbert's. Gorn was involved there, and that ball was out. It'll be a boundary throw in. He finds the ball on the deck. Lays it off to Maloney. Kick inside the forward 50. Gorn came at the pack. Falls in front. Taken by Fletcher. Trengove another. And they're just out from their own goal square. Off hands. Chance for Melbourne again. Spills off Scully. Over the football. Watts. Tries a high ball. Hooker in a good spot. Gorn. And now oh. Jara. But Jara is normally so clean. And Last clean. game. McKenzie to McDonald. Now Gisbert's. Gorn, he's not six foot ten. He's not two hundred and eight centimetres. Watts has got it. A long week ahead for Cole, as we said before. Howard up to fourteen possessions now. So still very much in this match, the Demons. Hold him, your free kick. So Max Gorn, the big guy. It's a Scully. Watts, but again, the advantage not quite working. Here's Gorn on the wing. Okay, he kicks it down towards the fifty. Well played by Watts. Yeah. I think sometimes you just hope, don't you? So Gorn there, and then Gorn again. Goes back. Gisbert, can he kick a left foot goal? Well, Tringo's got the temperament to kick it. I'm not sure if he's got the length and the kick. He won't get there. Big fly at the back by Gorn. And uh, down to you, Richo. Let's see, Gorn. We've got Gorn can. At last, it's a breakthrough. Gorn goes down to the goal square. How about that? <laughs> he's made too many first games he's down their it. own ISO game. Would they oh, be Gorn can? Oh, uh, yes. Ball comes back, but they dropped it down, then tackled. Good decision by the umpire ball up. That was good stuff by Melbourne. Yeah, yeah. Which, and in particular tonight. So Gorn holds his uh, body well there against Hill. Pennell tucks it under his arm and kicks it short to be Gorn in the back pocket. And then Gorn's little one to Gisbert's. Jim Stein started with that 37. He'd be pretty happy at the moment. And then kicks the ball to about 40 metres. Green and Fletcher. Love it, Murray. Gorn. Back it comes. Myers. And to Jetta. Back to Green. Green hooks it across the body. It floats down towards the pocket. And the big guy, Gorn, has taken the mark. First right time they've kicked it to him, Dennis. Once they kick it to him, he's marked it. That's right. Well, he's got his own camp. He's on a very sharp angle here. I think he's been the ultimate decoy tonight in his full forward role. Well, this is the go-on cam right here, Dennis. That's right. Said to be 210 centimetres, runs around, and he misses to the near side. Suddenly, their future, as we said, off to Perth for their next game. Admittedly, Fremantle have a few injury problems as well, but they've got to get some key personnel back. Nicholson did well there a minute ago. The sub. Gorn, well done. Tringove out of the contest to centre half forward. Gets it across to Maloney. Maloney about 60 metres out. Melbourne in best position. And the big guy. It's good luck. It was. He might be 208 centimetres. <laughs> I've said a lot. He's been he's been at full forward. I reckon about 80 percent of the game, but they haven't really kicked the ball at him. But in this last quarter, when the ball's gone to him, he's taking that mark on the angle, and that was a good, strong one. Great that confidence front. there from his skipper Brad Green. Sat off it. Often you'd see a teammate jump into the equation. Interesting stance he's got here next yeah. quarter. So if he kicks this, you would assume he's the man with the right aim. That should just about seal 
Essendon Spade. Whoa, he's got it to go at right angles. Well, almost. Now, the umpire insisting the wrong ball is in play just for the moment. Well, it's the same ball, but he needed to go to the bag. So many players who have been maligned suddenly bouncing back tonight as they get set to sing a song that they haven't sung for a little while. That grand old flag. Well, it's flying very bravely at this ground tonight.